Okay, so I'm gonna do a second take on uh, the video I just made because I realized I had my headphones in. So you guys heard candid uh, potato um, microphone. So basically, it was a video on the new Fast and Furious 9 trailer and um, <clears throat> I said that the new Fast and Furious 9 trailer was like a five-year-old's wet dream when playing with Hot Wheels. <clears throat> Here's the pitch of this said five-year-old. <clears throat> so, we have this guy named Dom and Brian. We have these guys named Dom and Brian. They started a street races and they come up with this... They become secret agents for this guy named Hobbs. And then, all of a sudden... All of a sudden, Dom has a secret brother... And then, they go up into space by Fast and Furious 9. And you're sitting there as a parent going, How did Uncle Kenny get you drugs? And, and then, you're like, Kid, I just wanted to watch a racing movie. Uh, can you pitch the idea again? Well, Han comes back to life, even though he died in Furious 7 by being pinned under... Pinned under his car, and then the car exploded, and he was killed by Jason Statham, and it was a very impactful death. And there's a there's actually there was actually a body that they found, and there was a it was a there was a grave and everything. <clears throat> uh, Junior, uh, Fast and Furious is supposed to be about street racing, and doing radios, and you know heists and criminals and all that stuff. Oh, and then Vin Di and then Vin Diesel spouts off about family for the nine thousand fucking time. Hey, hey, don't use that language. Fuck you, Dad. See, see what I mean? Like, see what I mean? Like, there, there was a, see, there's a, a, a movie series that tackled the subject of family a lot better. <clears throat> that series was called... You may not have heard of it. Uh, it's called uh, Lethal Weapon. Lethal Weapon. It tackled the subject of family a lot better. Rig starts out with a guy looking for a family. He ends with a guy accepting a family. And then it goes from there. He considers Roger's family his family. And then he ends up having a family of his own by the fourth movie. Th that's the thing. They tackled the thing within four movies, supposedly five. Uh, supposedly, uh, there's going to be a fifth one. I, I don't know. Uh, supposedly, there's going to be a fifth one, uh, according to Mel Gibson. Um, but anyway. Oh, and then you got um, you got Michelle Rodriguez. Dumb! As he falls like a thousand feet. She falls like a thousand feet and falls into water and survives. Just, he's okay. He's okay. It's it's not like a noble human being would fucking die or anything if that happened. Because water doesn't, you know, doesn't, you know, feel like concrete when you jump a certain amount of feet into into it. And, uh, oh, um, yeah, uh, another thing is that, uh, oh, yeah. Did I mention the going into space now? People were making jokes like, oh, uh, like, uh, like last year, like, oh yeah, like the next movie's gonna be, it be gonna be in space. So I'm like, might as well be, right? Well, uh, it turns out we went that far off because apparently the writers, you know, took the meme seriously and was like, that's a good idea. Write that down. Write that down. Write that down. And then uh, apparently they're going to space now, like. Yeah, like, uh, why, why not, why not go into TARDIS and then go and fly off in the DeLorean or something, and go fly in a, fly in DeLorean or something, and then go, 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 go beat the shit out of the, beat the shit out of Dark Side and Thanos at the, simultaneously at the same time. Or, how about you, you know, go, go freaking warp speed, go freaking warp speed with freaking Commander Data and Captain Jean-Luc Picard. You know, how about you do that for the next movie? You might as well. Anyway, guys, I will see you in the next video. Uh, this franchise is getting ridiculous. Oh, and uh, 
<clears throat> the series show ended when uh, Paul Walker died and they wrapped up Furious 7. See you guys in the next video.